All right, what is going on everyone? Jeremiah here from Danger TV and today is another vlog. <clears throat> it is literally so early in the morning right now. It's not even six o'clock yet because I've been trying to wake up early. Just a normal day. I hope you guys do enjoy it. Let's go. Guys, today I'm actually selling my Blue Yeti microphone, so we're gonna be taking that later down to a gas station. And you guys are thinking, why are you selling your Blue Yeti, bro? That's a good microphone. It is, yes, but I'm getting this microphone that's better. It's called the AT2020. Hopefully that mic will be good. I think it will. Gotta make some cappuccino, guys. Well guys, now it's just the whole idea of trying to get this to my room without spilling it. Mission accomplished. Since it's so early, I get to start up my PC and chill for a little bit. Alright guys, I'm done chilling. Now I have to go get ready for school, the fun part of the day. So I'm about ready to go to school. I'm not going to vlog anything right now because I'm just ready to go to school, get everything done, come back and then I'll vlog because later on we're going to sell that microphone so I gotta vlog that because it's the death of my microphone I'll see you guys after school alright guys I'm back home and just chilling at home now and it's just so weird for me because I'm used to seeing the blue Yeti just here but it's not here anymore but tomorrow I'll have the AT2020 there, so in a little bit we're going to go sell the Blue Yeti. Alright guys, so I've been chilling here for a little bit. We're about to go sell the microphone pretty soon when Grandma gets off work. She should be here in about 5 or 10 minutes. Can't believe we're actually selling it. Oh no. As we're about to leave, we see this all the time. The little cat just sits there at the window. Oh, he's getting in the window. There he is. Oh, look it. Yeah. up here to sell it. Guys, so we're here now at the gas station where I'm we're gonna here, sell I'm early. Okay, we're here too. Boom. Blue Yeti. Gonna be gone soon. Alright guys, so we just sold the Yeti. I have 60 bucks here for it, so this is gonna either go off to pay the AT2020 or maybe to get my curved monitor that I'm planning on getting. I don't really know what it's going to yet, but something. <laughs> Guys, we're getting gas, you know, so the car can run. Hi, may I help you? Yes, I need two double cheeseburgers, plain. He doesn't want anything on him but the cheese. 933, your first window. Thank wait a minute, wait, wait, wait. It's not right. I'm sorry, you said no ice? No. I said an order of fries. Lord. Oh, sorry. That's okay. It's like it's in water. No. Give him nothing. Can I get you anything else? No, that'll be all. All right. Ten forty-one at your first window. Thank you. Giving us problems at the window. How dare them? You see that? You see what McDonald's is? We got to McDonald's, we started ordering our food and all that. And so, what they did was, we ordered fries, right? And so they said that we ordered a water, a large water with no ice. ice. No ice. No ice, no ice. And so, 
that's what they put on there, right? And Grandma goes, that's not right. So they're like, okay, what did you order? Large fry, we told them. And then they're like, okay. And so they gave us the fries, everything was fine. But then once we got to the window, the second window where they give you your food, they were gonna give us a water too. So the person that did this, like that took the order, probably didn't take the water off of the order in general. So that means we got charged for a water too, I guess. And I know it's only a quarter, like it's really not a big deal, but it's not even that though. It's just like, really? Get the order right. <laughs> like honestly. If you're gonna work at a job, at least do it. Correctly. <laughs> yeah. All right, guys, so we got home. We got done selling the microphone. Everything went good. But anyway, I'm just chilling at home now. I'm about to go on a Call of Duty grind, probably, because I need to get some Call of Duty clips because me and Daniel are going to be doing a Call of Duty montage. Now, I'll be explaining this better in one of my videos on my channel because I don't want to explain it on the vlog channel completely yet because I want that to kind of be one of the things that I explained to the gamer kind of group of my channel because some people on this channel might not even like games so that's fine I'm not going to explain it I'm just saying there's going to be a Call of Duty montage that we're working on and if you want further information on it I'll have some more information up on it like in a few days or so on my Evog Exaltic channel link in the description below it always is and so is Daniel's channel so anyway guys yeah I've just been chilling like I said probably about to go on a Call of Duty grind trying to think of some music for a montage so I was over here looking up some music so I might just extend this vlog into two days so that's probably what I'm gonna end up doing it is like quarter after 10 now and I've been playing Call of Duty so I was on the Call of Duty grind trying to get some clips I think I got a couple nothing too crazy but anyway I have to do homework guys freaking homework I forgot about it whenever you're on a Call of Duty grind you don't really think about homework alright guys so I just got done with my homework it really didn't take that long like it's only 1032 so it only took like 15 minutes really I'm not gonna vlog anymore tonight I'm gonna pick up the camera tomorrow morning and I'll see you guys in the morning hope you guys have a rest of a good night why am I saying this I'm not even in the vlog yet alright guys it is the next morning and it's too early <laughs> even though it's really not it's still too early I'm tired but I gotta go to school again. It's Friday, and yeah, last day of school for this week. Thank God. But anyway, guys, I'm gonna get up, get ready, and go to school. All right, guys, I just got done eating breakfast. Now I'm gonna go get dressed for school. Ugh, I'm not ready for school, honestly. Like I don't want to go to school today at all. Like I usually don't, but I really don't want to today. All right, guys, I just got home from school. But guess what, guys? The AT2020 microphone is here. I have it now, oh my gosh. But I'm gonna unbox it here real quick. Nothing crazy, not like a review, but kind of. So this vlog's kinda turning into a review at this point. So hopefully you guys do enjoy this part of the vlog. Let's get into it. Here is the package, right here. Got my knife, gonna use it to open it. So guys, this should be pretty cool. AT2020, definitely a good microphone. We're just gonna see how good it is though. Um, now I'm not going to be doing any audio tests here. This is literally just an unboxing video right here. This part of it. It's like a first impression kind of deal. So, as I said, here it is. And here is the uh, shock mount for it. So I can go on my boom arm. And here is the AT2020. Here it is. Yes, I'm actually pretty hyped for this. It should be almost the same as the Yeti, but I can already tell it's so, so, so much smaller. Alright. So now for the hard part of the unboxing. Jeez. Actually, it's not hard at all. I'm just a retard. Alright, let's do that. And then pull this up. And then boom, we're into the package. So, we've got some stuff here. Got some of this, because that's the most important part, obviously. This, whatever that is, manual or something it looks like. Oh, they actually put foam packaging and crap in here. They got like a case. I don't know what's in that case, honestly. Um, and here is the AC2020, the actual microphone. So, very small compared to the Yeti, dude. Like, it's actually pretty heavy still. It's still not as heavy as the Yeti, though. The Blue Yeti is the previous microphone that I had. I'm sorry about that terrible noise. Okay, it's over now. So, I actually like that foam thing quite a bit for some reason. I don't know. Like, I won't ever use it, but I just like it. <laughs> okay, so there's that. 
And here's this leather case. I don't know if it's genuine leather. I really doubt it, but it's cool though. So it actually came with this little thing, which is surprising. That's all that it came with. It didn't come with a stand, but I'm surprised it even came with that, honestly. And here is the shock mount for it. Because I gotta have a shock mount for it for a boom arm. Oh, it's like I hear some things in there. There's what they are. I need those. I can't wait to see how this sounds, though. All right, all right. So just a standard shock mount, nothing too crazy. So you just pinch these two together to fit it in. Boom. I just realized something that made me really mad, and I feel like a complete retard. Like honestly, I feel, like I know I always say this, but I mean, like I actually feel dumb. Like literally feel dumb. So what I ordered was an XLR connection. As you can see there, it is not a USB connection. I thought I ordered the USB connection. I did not. It is the XLR. So, what I have to do is now I have to wait for a freaking mix amp to come in, which is okay, but it's just annoying is what, it's just annoying, that's all. It's just annoying because I got this microphone today, I was planning on using it, I can't use it for another two or three days now. So, I feel like a retard now, oh well, that's what happens to me in life, so I'm used to it, but whatever. Alright guys, so here's what the AT2020 looks like, completely set up. Well, almost completely. See, because I've got the boom arm here, and look at the XLR connection right there. It's focused in on it. So that's the XLR connection. Luckily, this boom arm came with a built-in XLR connector, which is actually really cool. I was actually really surprised about that. So I already have an XLR connection. I just don't have the mix amp or something like that that I can use. So I'm going to see. This is what I used to use for the Blue Yeti. Little windscreen here. I want to see if it fits on here. I, I think it will. It actually does. Yes, dude. It actually fits. Actually fits. That's good. And then I can put the pop filter over it, and then then we're then we're set, guys. So there we go. That's the mic set up. Looks pretty good if I say so myself. And it's not quite as heavy as the Yetis either, so it doesn't weigh down the stand that much. So anyway, that's it for the review part of this video because I can't even use it yet because there's no XLR connection. Freaking Phantom 48 volt power crap. Okay. See, because I thought I got the USB version, and I didn't. I hate my life. Except, I'm glad that I got this, actually, because it's, it's going to sound better than the USB, so I don't care. I just have to wait a couple more days. Yeah, guys, I really screwed up, because now I have to buy this thing, and it's fine to buy it, because it's going to be better anyway than a USB, but it costs 47 bucks. So, that is something that I have to buy now. It's the, basically, sound card kind of deal, and yeah. It'll be in here Tuesday. By Tuesday, it'll be at my house. So, yeah, then I'll get to use it Tuesday. And currently, it is Friday. So, you guys are seeing this vlog on Saturday. And I really did screw up bad. Alright, guys, I'm going to go ahead and end today's vlog here. I know I screwed up so bad, I feel like an idiot. But, because I thought it said USB. I thought it said USB, not XLR connection. So, that's what I did. I ordered that. I ordered the sound capture thing just so it could, you know, do its thing. And I got it all set up over here, as you guys seen earlier. But yeah, guys, that's going to end it for today's vlog. Hopefully, you guys did enjoy. I know this vlog was kind of weird. It was spaced out. Stuff was kind of jumpy. I'm sorry about that. But that's just how the vlog ended up <clears throat> being this time. So it, don't expect that all the time. But it just happened this time. But anyway, guys, I hope you guys' day was good. And yeah, guys, I will see you guys in the next video. Later.